Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to convert your Wix website to WordPress in 2023. So we'll guide you through the process of doing that. And while Wix offers a user-friendly website builder, you may find that WordPress provides more flexibility and customization options. So by following these steps, you can seamlessly transition your websites to WordPress platforms. So let's get started. Before we start with this video, Make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience. So the first step, of course, is just go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. In my case, I'm actually going to use the Brave browser. And of course, in your case, you can go and open whatever preferred browser or whatever browser you have in your PC. Once you do so, go to the URL section. You'll like to go and open both Wix and WordPress, of course. So just go and type wordpress.com and wix.com, open them separately. And of course, you'll have to go and log in into your account, both of WordPress and Wix. And if you don't have an account, you can simply go and, or create your account, sorry, and both uh, websites. Of course, if you don't have any websites or, or anything, you can go and create your own. I have a lot of videos on how to do that if, if you would like to, to go and check. And once you have your WordPress or your website is set up, you will have, of course, to even set up a WordPress website. So the first step is to set up a WordPress website. You will have to go and sign up to with a reliable WordPress hosting provider and install the WordPress on your domain. And of course, this process typically involves choosing a hosting plan, uh, selecting a domain, and following the hosting provider instructions to install the WordPress. And before diving into the conversion process, you can take some time to plan the structure and design of your new WordPress website. And of course, even consider how you want your pages, menus, and content to be organized. You can even take note of any custom features and functionalities that you would like to recreate in WordPress. Then you can export the content from your Wix website. So in order to transfer your content from your Wix to WordPress, you will need to export it from your Wix website. So in your Wix dashboard, as an example, you can simply look for the option export your site content and this might be labeled as download site or something similar like save the exported file on your computer. So as an example, you can go to whatever site, click on the three dots and as you can see, you'll have here a rename site, a gift key feedback, view live site, change owner, add collaborators, duplicate sites, move to folder or move to trash. If we get into the sites example, simply click one and left click on it. This will get you into the Wix uh, editor of it. So as you can see, here's your site. You can simply click on edit sign as an example or site. And here you'll be able to find your site. And of course, you may uh, de do any changes that you would like to do before even exporting your site as an example or downloading it. So you can go and do whatever uh, changes you would like to do on it. And of course, once you do so, you will be able to import your content to WordPress. So now it's time. Once you exported your uh, video from the Wix, you will have to go. Or now it's time to import your content into WordPress. So you can simply go into your WordPress dashboard, navigate to tools. Uh, here and of course make sure to click on this import option and as you can see I want to import content from Wix and here you'll have to simply enter the URL of your site of course there's other option if you want to as example simply uh, upload whatever you downloaded or you can simply go and use this URL section of course uh, there are various imports uh, plugins available such as WordPress importers or uh, importer or all in one uh, WP migration. You can install and activate the plugin as an example if you want to use some plugins of your choice and follow the instructions to import the contents from your Wix uh, export file. And of course, once your content is important, you can customize it. So as an example here, you can go to your Wix site and as we said, click on site. You can go here to transfer site and this will open a new tab for you. And of course here, let's just wait course you'll have to connect it to a custom domain as an example or just the domain name or the url that uh, wix given you and you will have to go and paste it here or as you can see you can even uh, transfer it through the email address but this is just for wix users of course so if you are not wix users you'll not be able to do so here so give it a custom domain name of course this will require a plan for you and once you have your domain name just go and paste it here and you will have it right here on your WordPress and of course uh, once you have it you will uh, once you, your content is important it's just time to customize it uh, your WordPress website to match the design and functionality of your Wix site you can choose as an example uh, a WordPress theme 
and closely run bless your Wix website design or hire even a web designer to create a custom theme for you or you can even go look online for those there's a lot of or plenty of those themes that you can find even for free of course you can even as an example configure your theme settings and menu and widgets to recreate the desired looking functionality and if your Wix websites had any custom features or functionalities that are not available through the standard websites plugin, you'll need to rebuild them. So you, this may involve researching and installing like some specific plugins or hiring a developer to create a custom functionalities for your Wix website. And of course, this will be able to do it on your local host of your Wix website. Uh, so you'll have to go log in into it and do so. And of course, to ensure like a smooth transition or for your Wix visitors and maintain your SEO ranking, set up the URL redirects from your Wix website to your new website site. So let me just log in into my uh, local host. And of course, uh, you can use or as I said, set up the URL the redirection from your Wix website to your new WordPress site. And you can use the redirection plugin or consult with your hosting provider to con uh, to configure like the necessary the redirect. And of course, this will help you preserve your website traffic and search for engine rankings. So here you can install whatever plugin you want by going and click on add new, as I said before. So you'll be able to do so from this local host. And of course, once you're completed the customization and rebuilding the process, uh, through really uh, test your Wix website, or oh, sorry, your WordPress website at the moment, uh, to ensure that everything is functioning correctly. And of course, check your pages, links, uh, forms, uh, and any interactive elements. When you are satisfied with the results, it's time, of course, to launch your new WordPress website. So if you find anything like not working, well, you can always go back to your WordPress uh, website now and go and fix it or change whatever you want on it. Of course, if a plugin is not working, you can go back here and maybe it needs an upgrade or an update. You can simply go and look for the updates and give it an up update and etc. So go and check if everything is working. If something is not working, you can go and check for a solution for it. And of course, maybe if you didn't find a solution, as I said before, you can hire a someone that can help you of course a professional that will help you with everything kind of uh, even the conversion if you don't want to do it by your own and of course if you reach this point of this video congratulations you've successfully learned how to convert your wix website to wordpress in 23 of course by following these steps you can take advantage of wordpress fix flexibility in customization option so remember to plan your conversion exports and imports your content customize your wordpress website and rebuild any custom feature of course if you found this video helpful give us a thumbs up and subscribe for our channels or to our channels for more helpful tutorials like this one and of course if you have any concerns you can leave them down down below in the comment sections or maybe just go and contact uh, the support of wix or even wordpress if you're having any issues so thank you for watching again and we will see you in the next video